Hey boys, welcome back to some more Don Brown McCreed 17 spin bowling career mode. We're up against the West Indies in a five game ODI series, which is pretty exciting. And uh, we're the captain, so we're going to get to choose our squad, which is very, very nice because we can actually get rid of the players that shouldn't be here. So I made some changes, didn't show. It took me a fair while to actually get everyone I thought should be there. Um, but yeah, we're going to just uh, continue on. And I know it is a bit annoying because I did... I put up like a couple of cricket videos a while ago now and I wanted to get back into like more consistent cricket videos, especially to the lead up with the new game and also just the cricket season rolling around again. But uh, honestly, like I've just been like really busy in uh, in real life, personal life. Like it hasn't really affected, it hasn't really, well, it hasn't affected the break the league content at all because I've had like such a big backlog when I get a chance to record I, I like record a lot at a time so I mean there there are times where I don't record for like a fair while but when I do record I record like a heap so um yeah the rugby league stuff has gone up as usual but uh unfortunately the cricket I just haven't been able to like get them up consistently but hopefully we can we can start doing that it's just you know sort of I guess the other point of that is when I do like a lot of stuff in a row. So I still sort of just feel like playing more rugby league live four at the moment because I do find the game very fun and I do like making the videos on it. It's also sort of just I'd rather do that at the minute as well. But um, I do like getting back into the cricket. I like the cricket videos and the spin bowling cream mode. Like it's only actually how many? I actually don't know how many episodes we've um we've done of the spin bowling cream mode. It's been like a fair few, but probably not as many as I originally thought we would. Um, so you know, we'll uh, we'll definitely continue on here in the lead up to the Ashes cricket game. But uh, we're going to get off to a hopefully good start. We do make the catch. I was I was panicking for a second there, just trying to get the uh, it lined up. But we do get uh, Roston Chase with uh, with a nice little caught and bowled you know since the latest patch which is just come out like a fair while ago now uh caught and bowls and fielding off your bowling is you know you don't really do it much anymore but it was nice to get that little opportunity the west indies they're not going too bad the run rate is you know it's it's probably pretty fine for this stage you would you would assume but um five wickets down is not where you want to be as uh, i thought we had another wicket there but He's actually picked out the gap. It was a bit of a bit of a strange shot there by Rifa. Um, but he's just blasted it over mid on, so no, not not a horrible shot. It's right here. It was a beautiful ball. I, I don't really know what I was appealing for. I it looked like I think Matthew Wade is the keeper, and it, it looked like it was a missed stumping opportunity because it did hit. His, I don't know. I think it hit his pad, and I think uh, Wade missed it. But yeah, I'm gonna get one to slide across. Bishu, he was struggling. Uh, he gets out for a duck off uh, off five deliveries, and uh, a decent breakthrough. Obviously, we're just sort of picking up wickets fairly consistently here. But uh, you know, a little bit of a a wide angle of the crease. I think it was the wrong end going away from him, and uh, a nice bit of keeping by uh, by Matty Wade there. As uh, we got uh, the figures are two for twelve, which is which is quality. I do, yeah, you know. People, people still complain about this game. I personally still think the game is a lot better than Don Brown McCricket 14. There are some annoyances that uh, haven't been fixed, but right here, absolute, oh, absolute ripping a delivery. We're going to get him out, caught behind. It's annoying though. I hate it when this happens, where they sort of like go into the crease thinking about challenging, and then you don't get to see the replay. Obviously, you can go back and like manually go into the replay but i'll just i i just wish they would show the replay regardless it was a beautiful beautiful delivery and uh again we keep him by weight it would have got the stumping but he did did edge it is right here he's gone for the big shot he's picked out the fielder though should be another one but he's fucking put it down that uh <laughs> that is persistence uh persisted through the patch just simple drop catches on the boundary you know you would sort of expect international they shouldn't be dropping those as uh this one a top edge of the sweep shots he catches it and this is another issue with the game that hasn't really been fixed but thankfully if you do appeal for those they do end up giving them out like that you know the game sort of gets confused with the top edges in the game so 
if you don't appeal, then the umpire doesn't give it because I'm not exactly sure why, but if you do appeal for it, they, they end up giving it. I guess it's sort of like they, they treat it like a court behind. Um, so if you don't appeal, then they can't give it, even though it's just a catch. So yeah, that, that, that's one of the little issues, but, um, you know, as long as you appeal, you can still get the wickets. Uh, so yeah, like I was saying, there are still like a few issues in the game that it would be nice. It would have been nice if they fixed, but overall the game is, is a lot better than Don Brown and Cricket 14, in my opinion, especially the spin bowling. The spin bowling is excellent as, uh, we, we go up for the appeal because it was such a good, was such a juicy outside edge. I just couldn't believe it wasn't a wicket, but we finished our uh, our bowling innings there. We bowled superbly. We picked up some really nice wickets too. Um, just some really good spinning deliveries. Like, just, yeah, nice top edge trying to go for a sweep. Like, just realistic ones. Like, that, the sweep shot, the top edge, the short fine leg, um, you know, going out of the crease for the lefty, spinning away, catching the edge. Uh, the cordon bowled, you know, probably isn't doesn't happen all the time but yeah just um the wickets you get with a spin bowler in the game are fairly like realistic and they just look they look quality i love the spin bowling in this game and the the cream mode has been it's been a lot of fun obviously it's been off and on uh lately but uh, it's still good to get back we are coming in for a bit of a bat here we uh we've got the you know we've got the win pretty much sewn up here we've had a bit of a bit of a chance to come out and have a bit of a slog well not a slog but uh hit the winning runs i guess and get a little bit of um form with the bat we're not uh we're not killing it with uh with the bat in this career mode i think our average is like 20 something so you know not not fantastic but uh we are well, i don't think we've had too many chances in uh in internationals as we almost we almost run ourselves out um he just kind of got upstairs through oh man <laughs> Oh, he just would not slide the bat. I thought I was gone here. I didn't really watch the replay, but apparently we just snuck home. Uh, Steve Smith is uh, is killing 72 or 57. We need um, we don't need many more runs. We're, we're trying to hit the winning runs there. I think I think it was six to win, so we're trying to go long, hit the winning runs, but not to be. Uh, we do uh, scores a level, so all we have to do is hit a single. But usually we like to finish off in a bit of style and. Uh, we go over cover. I didn't actually see there was a man out there, but we clear him nicely. It was a beautiful shot inside out. And that is going to pick up the win. So a good start to this ODI five game series against the West Indies in Australia, obviously. And uh, we, we had a stellar game. We pulled beautifully. I can't remember what our figures were. We'll see him in a second here. And uh, yeah, we got a, we got a little go with the bat four for 30 didn't get the five for but we did pick up man of the match warner killed it smith um yeah warner was probably a bit unlucky not to get man of the match but hopefully you guys enjoyed the dom Brahman series like i said i'll try to be a bit more consistent and uh yeah i'll see you guys in the next one